Now to our running dry series. Trees found across Arizona, researchers are finding, can actually cool themselves down, almost sweat, even in the most extreme Arizona heat. But they need water to do that. 12 News journalist Colleen Secor reports on what's at risk. In Arizona heat. We're talking above 118 degrees Fahrenheit. These Fremont cottonwoods found across Arizona. That they use the water that they have access to to actually cool their leaves down. Able to cool off by essentially sweating. And the effect of that is that their leaves are up to 5 to 10 degrees cooler than the air temperature. Brad Posh, a postdoctoral research scientist at the Dryland Plant Ecophysiology Lab at the Desert Botanical Garden, leading a study with collaborators from NAU, finding these trees cool themselves off especially well, but they need water. What we did for our project, for instance, was to cut down the, the water supply for these trees for just three days. In summer of 2023, setting out Fremont Cottonwoods at the garden, groups of these trees ranging from cooler to hot Arizona climates, those three days of water cutback. And that was enough to completely disrupt their really efficient cooling mechanism. And what that led to? Were their leaves getting really, really hot, hotter than those really high air temperatures, and actually hot enough to start causing internal damage uh, to the metabolism and the, the physiology of, of the leaf. Posh says the trees that came from the hottest parts of Arizona could cool their leaves down the best. They did that the most out of any of the populations. But that came at the cost of being closer to the point at which they experience damage from drought stress. Drought and heat has already been shown to have led to Fremont cottonwoods dying off as they depend on steady access to water. We're seeing not just increases in the average temperatures around the globe, but we're also seeing uh, with that hotter heat waves, longer heat waves, and heat waves that are occurring more often. These trees, Posh says, are considered foundational to the ecosystem. These trees play a really important role uh, as a refuge for migratory birds as well. And so if these trees are threatened, then the birds often uh, face a problem as well. So is there anything that can be done to help these trees? Decisions about how we manage water in these habitats where these trees occur could be really, really important in determining whether these populations can survive these hotter, longer and hotter summers that we're looking at in the coming decades. Colleen Sikora, 12 News.